In January 2011, a severe Category 5 cyclone hit North Queensland and caused extensive damage to homes, crops and people's lives. The cyclone had hit a major banana farming industry in Queensland and destroyed most of the crops and food stores. The loss in production caused the prices of bananas to go from under $5 to above $12 a kilo. Had effects on the banana industry for multiple years afterwards in the process of redeveloping farms and plants. It cost the industry over $800 million. After 10 years of build up, the sales of kale and quinoa rose rapidly in 2014 due to the apparent superfood trend. This trend was heavily influenced by marketers, food activists on media, social media platforms such as Facebook. In the same year, the Australian state government began to influence uh, food manufacturers to provide consumers with health star ratings on packaging. It was a response to the rising obesity levels whereby food ratings were given uh, from 0.5 to 5 stars. This is dependent on the healthiness of the food, so these, and a measure of potential risk factors and nutrients within the food. In 2016, an agreement between state and territory consumer affairs ministers reclassified the definition of free range for eggs. The new regulation means that farms can now have uh, only 10,000 hens per hectare and provide them with meaningful uh, and regular outdoor times. All Aldi, Coles and Woolworths farms that sell products like these must operate under this standard um, for animal welfare. Animal welfare groups and consumer groups, however, argue for further reductions to 1,500 hens per hectare. Also in 2016, the ACCC began laws which require food producers to label the country of origin. So they look a bit like that. Um, this applies to all retail sold products, excluding packaged products such as food and fi uh, fish and fruit. Sorry. The effect of social media has grown massively for food in 2017, with trends relating to whether food products are deemed Instagrammable. The effects on products such as avocado toast caused the increase of avocado prices due to the high demand for the product. And most recently in 2018, the strawberry industry was greatly affected by the contamination of strawberries with needles. This causes an initial drop in sales with wholesales cancelling orders for, uh, for trays and selling trays for under $13 of market value. However, the support to buy this fruit, this fruit on social media by federal government and uh, it increases sales beyond expectations.